this goes back to what I was saying about the, the need for comprehensive sex education is that there are so many myths about vasectomies that if you do, a, if you're in whatever GIF engine or GIF search engine and you type in the word vasectomy, then you tend to see uh, scissors or, or like scissors cutting bananas and things like that to, to imply that this is going to cut your dick off or something. And, and that alone, it should be enough for people to recognize like, no, we need some proper education around this. And so I feel like if there was more education around vasectomies, then it would take the fear away from it. I was awake from my, from my vasectomy. I watched it happen. I was talking with the doctor. Um, the, my doctor that performed my vasectomy actually performed his own vasectomy. And that's when I knew I was like, yep, yeah, that's the guy I want. Uh, but it's, it was a painless procedure. The, like the, only, the only piece of it that did have some pain was initially when they were you know, putting in the, uh, they were anesthetizing the area. Uh, other than that, the recovery was pretty quick. You know, I feel fine after the fact. I'm happy to answer any specific questions anyone has about a vasectomy, but I bring this up specifically on today because they're, you know, short of, short of buying yourself a Supreme Court seat, uh, then there's not much that can be done to change the laws in this country, okay? However, as an individual, as, as anyone out there in the world that has a penis and produces sperm, I would strongly encourage them to, if, if you either know that you don't want kids, or, or even if you're not sure, I still encourage a vasectomy because they're reversible. When I tell people I got a vasectomy, they say, oh, you must hate kids. I'm like, no, I hate accidents. Because <laughs> I, I, actually, I actually love kids. I do. But I don't, you know, at 44, I don't want to be surprised. You know, no. It's, I don't think, I mean, hmm, there are people who are like, well, pregnancy doesn't happen by surprise. And I'm like, well, I don't like surprises, especially not ones that are, I mean, you know, that's a big commitment. And yeah, it is, it is really, really sad because this has taken rights away from a specific group of people and it's going to have ramifications that are going to consist for quite some time. Um, last comment, Venom, uh, Five four. Education is available in few sources, but indoctrination is public. Published in the public, pushed in the public. So yeah, <clears throat> very real. That's true. Yeah.